What's up guys, my name is Cartoons, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to snipe with Lucian's Q. And it's kind of a masterful ability uh, to be able to use this. It takes a lot of practice, so don't worry if you get a little bit frustrated at the first time. It's not a huge deal, you can always get it the next time. So, um, what the piercing light ability is, and this is the, honestly the coolest AD carry ability in my opinion with any kind of AD carry, is that it shoots a bolt of uh, piercing light through an enemy unit and damages all enemies in the line that that, um, in the line of damage so if i were to do if i were to line this up right um as you can see i just hit this one minion here it has to lock on him but it also does damage to everything in that line and there's a lot of versatility to be done with that and i think that there's a lot of unspoken knowledge about how to use this and i'm here to teach you how to do it so how to snipe um is really simple I just did it right there. All, honestly, all you do is you put a minion in between you and the enemy target, and then you use your Q. So, as you can see... Uh, it, it's kind of hard when they're sidestepping. Uh, it's, it's a little bit more difficult to do it, but as you do it more and more, uh, you get a little bit more and more practice. So, as you can see there, like you just use your Q on an enemy minion, and then it, if you line it up perfectly, you'll also get harassed on the enemy target. And that's mainly what it's used for, is it's used for in lane whenever you have... Um, an enemy target you need to get harassed on. Uh, you can just use your Q into an enemy minion, line it up with the enemy target, and you'll get free harass onto an enemy target. So it, he's lower health than you, and you also don't take any damage in return because it's a really long range ability. Um, but it takes a while to get used to, and once you do, you get better and better at it. And obviously, you know, people miss all the time, but once you finally get to a point where you can at least hit like four out of five of them, you'll be in a really good position. Um, but the main thing it's used for is again to harass. And another thing that's really cool is you can also use your Relentless Pursuit, which is your E, your dash. Um, and you can use it into a Q, so you can line up with your E and then land some pretty cool snipes as well. So, if I were to E into this, right? And then um, you use your Q at the same time. And sometimes it doesn't sync up correctly, so you kind of have to be a little bit lenient with it. Um, because sometimes it doesn't work out the way you want it to. Uh, I've had some trouble with using my Relentless Pursuit into my Piercing Light lately, and it, it's just sometimes kind of lags and doesn't really sync up with your character correctly. So what you have to do is you have to Relentless Pursuit, and then you kind of have to like wait it like a, just a couple milliseconds, and then you can, um, it has to kind of like reset your character. But if you want to do the EQ combo, here you go. As you can see, I, I was out of range there, and then I E'd into him, which is my Relentless Pursuit. Um, E'd into him, and then used my Q, and it put me in range to be able to get the harass off. But be careful doing that, guys, because you can also get engaged on after you use your Relentless Pursuit. It's like your one escape, so just be careful. But in my opinion, the best feeling is whenever you get an EQ into a, uh, into a kill like this. I think getting an EQ onto a target makes you look awesome. It's like a way to make huge plays, and it also gets you a really, like a really stable kill. You don't ever have to worry about positioning yourself poorly to be able to get the kill. All you have to do is land the Q in between. It takes a lot of practice, but you can get it. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And if you haven't already, I'd love for you to subscribe to my channel. I'll be releasing more and more uh, AD carry knowledge on how to do some pretty cool tricks. Uh, to get yourself higher elo and league of legends i'd love to show you uh, what i've learned over the time that i played but that does sum it up for me today guys if you would feel free to leave a like on this video to show me some support and i'll see you guys next time cartoons out